channel my name is Arlene Sandinez. Today's video is all about Ikea. Come shopping with me. Lots of organizing. There's just so much to do around here. We moved in a few months ago and there's still things that are not organized or put away um, just because I feel like I don't have a place to put them. So I'm gonna go get like some shelves, other stuff, a little bit of clean with me, a lot of just home kind of stuff. So hopefully you guys end up enjoying this video. If you guys do, give it a big old thumbs up, subscribe, turn on your post notifications, and let's get started. All right, you guys, here is the reality of my bathroom currently. I was gonna clean it first and then show you guys exactly what I wanna do, but I figured, you know what? I'll clean with you guys and tell you guys my plan. So I actually wanna put a few of the Ikea shelves up right here, maybe like three or four of them, but my only concern is if I put them here, it might kind of close off this space into the closet and like into the little toilet seat area or I can put them right here against this wall and it can look pretty, but then I'm afraid that like when you walk in through this front door right here that it might look just kind of cluttered and messy. So I don't know, I, um, but for now let's clean this up. It's honestly a lot of skincare that's just up here. I really want these little shelves to put all my skincare on because I have a ton of it. <laughs> I'm also in need of a toothbrush holder. I haven't found one that I absolutely love, and now it's getting to the point where I'm like, I just need to settle for anything because we literally don't have one. walking around to get inspo and I just found this table that I fell in love with. It's like wooden and then it has black legs. And it's only $4.49. And I've been looking for a new dining table. This one looks so cute. Also, I see these frames back here. These are all the shelves. I think I like those little ones to the right. They're nice and small and dainty. This is so cool. I've never seen it before. I don't know if I'd want it out about in the kitchen or if I can put it in the pantry and it could be hidden, but it could still look really nice and organized. These baskets I also need because they'll make $12.99. I'm going to put them in the laundry room and I like that it has a little pull handle on it so I can actually like pull down whatever I'm trying to get down because our laundry room is a mess also. I found something super cool. So this is supposed to be a shoe rack, but I think I'm going to put it under the sink to kind of organize like all of our cleaning supplies. And then I'm not even gonna do this bottom little mat thing. I'm just gonna do the two shelves. And they're only $4.99. I found the most perfect little shelves. They're super thin and they have a little ledge on them. So I can definitely put my skin on them. These are the perfect size. I won't get ahead of myself, but I know where to come for a lot of Christmas decor. These guys down here are only $20. I can even put these outside too on the front porch. Okay, I'm back from Ikea. I'm gonna show you all the things that I got for like the downstairs like kitchen area. I got these two bamboo bowls. I just think these are so cute. Like I could imagine putting like an acai bowl or even like salads and stuff. I think, I think these ones were $10 each. So I only got two of them. It's a little pricey. And then if I do end up using them a lot, I'll probably go back and get two more. Um, and then I also got these little like uh, glass jar things that come on these little stands. Um, I'm not exactly, I think I'm gonna put it in the pantry maybe somewhere out here in the kitchen. I also got the other one that kind of matches it. And this one comes with these tiny little like cylinder guys. Um, this one they had displayed with like spices in it. I don't know exactly what I put in here. And then the only other thing for downstairs are these two little like shoe rack guys. I showed these to you in store, but basically they just like stack up on each other. And I'm gonna put these underneath the sink and then organize all of our cleaning supplies and everything because it's getting ridiculously messy in there. So I'm gonna organize that. You can also put this under like your bathroom sink. I might even end up doing that too or go back for more. Okay, now we can move back onto the kitchen. So down here is all of the cleaning supplies and everything. This little guy is also from Ikea that organizes all of the grocery bags since we can reuse them that way. Um, it's not too crazy, but I feel like it's it just doesn't look good and it's getting bad, so I'm gonna use those shoe racks to organize it all and just have like a better plan overall. But you guys don't realize how 
how dirty it can get down here. So this little vacuum thing is from Amazon. I will get down below also. There's a spider. <laughs> I'm gonna suck it up. I hope he died in there. This top one isn't gonna work. Two does not work, but that's still a toilet pen. I can still use one. Yeah. Voila! Oh my gosh, so much better already. <laughs> How much better does that look? Okay, this looks so much better. That was so easy. Like, I was able to put stuff down here. It literally just gave me an extra shelf. Okay, next up, I opened up these little kitchen organizer things that I showed you guys. I don't know exactly what they're called, but they're so cute. So here was the thing. I didn't know where to put them. I wanted to do the pantry, but it's not going to fit at all because it needs to fit on this bar, which is kind of long. So I think I'm going to put it here. I also thought of the perfect thing to put in here, these pods. So I thought this was so cute. I did also get that from Ikea. But this, I can put in the pantry and find something else to put inside. Imagine the pods in here. Um, and these ones right here are actually for ice to coffee or like an ice espresso. Um, and then the other pods I'll put in here. So I'll put ice pods in here, regular in here, or however, just mix it up. But I think that'll look so cute. And then I could take that off the counter, get a little more counter space here, and it's going to look so cute. Wouldn't you want to leave behind? Okay, after much trial and error, finally got it on. I am sweating. I made a few extra holes that you can't see, and Weston won't know unless he watches this entire thing. So let's figure out how to put this on. Cold eyes, cold looking. I don't want to talk before the moment's lonely zips away. That is so stinking cute. Okay, and then this one, the smaller little cylinders that I don't know what to put in here. So upstairs, I brought up all the, or Wes helped me bring up all these Ribba frames. These ones are the square ones. I'm not sure the exact size, but I got these for the bathroom. I only got two of them. And then I got, oh my gosh, this thing. I don't know how to say that, but it's basically like this hanging chandelier with real candles that you put on it. I got the real candles also. I'm going to hang this over the bathtub and it looked really cute. And then I got a ton of the other, not a ton, I got three of the other big huge frames that I have in my office. Then over here, I got this rug. I'm gonna put this in the hallway upstairs. The candles that go with that little chandelier thing. And then these are the shelves that I ended up going with. I went back and forth between so many different ones. These ones are actually supposed to be for frames, but I just thought they're like the perfect size. They're not gonna take up any space, really. They're not gonna close off the closet and I could just put them up right there. I ended up getting four of them. I'm not sure if I'll do three or four, but I'd rather have extra than not enough. And then I got these two baskets for the laundry room. And then that's just a poster board for the frames. So yeah, let's set everything up. Okay, looks simple and cute. Meanwhile, I got this little handyman here doing all the dirty work, huh? Don't talk to your handyman. <laughs> Why, you're too focused? Focused on the task at hand. Team effort. Yeah. That's the rule number one. <laughs> rule number one. There's no I in team. So I ain't gonna lose ya. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. Darling, but lose ya. I ain't gonna lose ya. We're on to plan B because the other one, the monkey hook didn't work, so we're using these little guys. The, we gotta put the candles in too, right? Yeah, those are easy. Can we make it higher? Okay, and take three. We shortened it up. <laughs> it was way too low. Yay! That looks way better. Look at that serene little bathtub. Do we like it? 
I would move that thing to the center. This is everything we did today. Oh, these prints, I forgot to mention. These are actually from Ikea. Normally I always go on Etsy and I like find a print, but I got a little impatient, so I just bought the ones that were there. And they're pretty cheap too, so they look cute. Okay, now I need to go put all my skincare on these shelves. So, I'm gonna finish just kind of organizing the rest of the skincare. I have all this stuff up here. This was all still packed away in a box. That's kind of embarrassing, I know, because we've been here for a few months already, but I didn't have anywhere to put it. So now that I have my whole little shelf thing going on, I'm so excited to put it all up there. I do have three shelves up right now. I think I am gonna add that fourth one that I got um, because I wanna put perfumes on that bottom one. And I think it'll look good too. So let's go finish organizing the skincare. <laughs> I think that's everything for now. The other stuff is gonna be stored away in my other like linen closet. I have like boxes of other skincare because I do get a lot. You guys know that and I love trying new stuff out. Okay, so I stopped at Home Goods on my way home right now from the gym. Um, I ended up getting this little tray right here. This was actually in like the kitchen section Which I knew to go there because that's where they have a ton of like trays and like little stands and stuff um, So I love that this is kind of like a wooden look and I love that it has these black candles I was about to take the tag off, but I wanted to show you first. It was only $14.99 These little candles were $6.99 each. I just feel like it gives it kind of like a woodsy Element while well, this is a lot more modern. I finally got a low toothbrush stand. It's just kind of a simple like understated marble. I didn't want anything too crazy. I got this matching little cup with it to stick the toothpaste in. And then we still have our little like cotton pads and Q-tips in this guy right here. So that's everything right there. I like that it's all just in like one little section and that matches kind of like the whole woodsy elements going on right here. So I think it looks really cute. I love that it has black handles. everything for this ikea video hopefully you guys enjoyed it and found it helpful give it a thumbs up if you guys did enjoy it that's always super helpful to me also follow me on instagram i've been posting a ton go follow me over there um subscribe turn your post notifications also did you guys notice my top is it not the coolest and cutest top <laughs> i'm obsessed with it i will link it down below actually i'll put it down below so you guys can get it yourselves it was super affordable it was like 15 ish dollars so okay yeah that's gonna be it i love you guys and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.